So the yellow creature that I am making came out to nothing what it was supposed to be like, and I was kind of upset about that, but I mean, it, I mean, you know, at least I did something similar to it. The east and south, no, the east and west, my bad, um, was supposed to be more circular. Those sides were supposed to be more circular, and it wasn't as much. It was still a little pointy. And then the north and south was supposed to be more triangular, but I didn't want it to be a triangle. Like, more pointy towards that, yeah. But, I mean, it was an epic fail, so. But, it's, it was close, but not that close, but close. Fimo is the polymer clay that I'm using currently right now as you're watching, which is the blue one, and I would rate that a 5 only because the dye would go on your hands and it was still hard to like mix, like to make it the polymer clay soft, more say. So I was kind of upset about that, but I have four different kinds of clay, which is Fimo, as I said, F-I-M-O, Sculpey 3, Craft Smarts, and Primo, Sculpey. So those are the four that I have, and the best out of those four, I would honestly say it was Sculpey 3, and it was nice and soft. The, the dye did not get on your hands, and it was, it was nice. But the Craft Smart was kind of close to the Fimo, but I mean it wasn't, I mean it still got on your hands, but it, it wasn't that hard to mix. And then the Primo was kind, kind of to the Sculpey, but it wasn't, it wasn't that bad. So if you want any information, just check out my other video about polymer clay. But I'm not a pro, so <laughs> I mean, I have some information that's useful idea I got from these polymer clay creatures was from my notebook as you can see. I drew some little creature things that I knew I wanted to do for polymer clay and pretty much none of them came out to the way I wanted them to become but at least they're close and at least I tried. So yeah. Now I'm just doing the circle ball thing <laughs> right now and all of these are kind of a fail to me, and I I don't know, but uh, I'm using the knife to kind of make it look like hair, because in the drawing I had like spiky hair, and later on I put like little sticks, polymer clay in to make it kind of spiky, but it's not really spiky, uh, so... <laughs> Yeah, and only two yeah. fell out, which is good so far, and, I mean, good at least, <laughs> so, yep, that's all I gotta say for this hot pink circle thing, none of the creatures I made, like, none of them had a specific color I wanted them to do, it's just like, I just wanna make it... So that's that. That's basically what it was. Like it did. It didn't really matter about the um, the color really. Although I did want the bunnyish creature thing to be white because I mean they. That's how I see them as <laughs> being white. Um. So yeah. And this square thing that I'm doing right now that actually came out pretty good, but. Now that I look back on it, I think it's a little too thick. I, like, I, it would have been better if it was kind of thinner, but I, I mean, I still like it. It's just, I wanted it thicker. It's not, it's not a big deal. So, right now I'm doing the bunny, and later on, you'll just see that I just totally stopped. But, I was gonna just, like, give up, but I'm not that easy on giving up, so... I just did it later on <laughs> I was just like you know what? I'm gonna take a break and then I finished it didn't come out as good but it came out better than right now what I'm doing because the head would not stay a circle and that made me really mad because I kept on putting the ears on so I mean and I there's different techniques you could have done but I chose to attach ears onto it which I believe was not the best idea but I mean 
I, I don't know. <laughs> At least I tried. So that's that. So the glaze that I use is I just saw Sculpey, um gloss glaze and I got this at Michael's and I've had it for a while so this is the bunny I made it's glazed now I didn't show you after it was baked I just showed you when it was done painting and glazed so at first I just gave up on the bunny then I was like you know what I'm gonna do this bunny so I did it so then I showed you the square and again it's glazed all of them are glazed and just now I was surprised because I picked up the ball circle thing that right there and one of the hairs fell out <laughs> so I was trying to look for it because it just fell down on my lap so there I'm showing you it that it fell down yeah pretty sad about that but at least it has some more hair or type of hair and I'm not a pro at these things I just kind of do these for fun so yeah that looks really retarded and it came out to nothing what it was supposed to look out. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.